All right, we are just going to move right on from that one. It is 416 this morning. Jed, your uh, radar's lighting up this morning in the Bob Mills Weather Center. Look how busy that map is, Storm. And none of it is frozen in, in Oklahoma, right? Uh, what's that? None of it is frozen no, no in frozen, Oklahoma. No frozen. Good. Yes, I thought you, you were talking about the map is frozen. Oh, no, 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 no. map <laughs> is, is, stall, is stalled right now in the first frame. Uh, you can see areas of rain here overnight kind of rolling on through, but the colors kind of widespread from wind uh, to winter weather. There's going to be a lot of winter weather across parts of Kansas, maybe in the Oklahoma panhandle uh, coming up. Uh, going into tomorrow that'll try to spread into Oklahoma by Thursday evening th uh, make that Wednesday evening uh, Thursday morning but right now the majority of the problems with the winter weather will be out in the panhandle there is some high winds to worry about today if you are traveling today traveling westbound get over to Amarillo high wind warning that means winds could gust today up near or above 60 miles per hour. So for our semi friends, our truckers that are going to be heading out that direction or very high profile vehicles, it is going to blow you around. Sometimes it can even tip those vehicles over if that wind does get strong enough. So be very careful. A lot of wind today and here's the rain. It's moving on through right now. Areas of showers passing through. Let's show you the advisors we have for you across the majority of Oklahoma. It's a wind advisory. That's for wind gusts that could close in on 50 in some spots today. So very windy conditions over Oklahoma. It'll be a south wind and then tomorrow we'll track some winter weather, especially out to the panhandle where there's already a winter storm warning posted for the far western part of Oklahoma in the panhandle. For us, main body of the state, it's rain this morning. No winter precip, no frozen temperatures. We're talking about just a good old fashioned rainfall here on this uh, Valentine's Day. So wet conditions cover the majority of the state right now. As we kind of zoom it in here, you see a couple barrages of this rain moving through. One's now up to the north of the metro. Another band now starting to slide up and into central Oklahoma. And some of the rain is heavy this morning. So you, you'll get out of the roads here this morning. The roads will be very sloppy, hydroplaning. Uh, again, the ponding on the roads definitely be possible this morning. So this is a morning you don't use your cruise control. If you got your young kids that are 16, they're just getting out of the roads, learning how to drive this stuff, make sure they don't use the cruise control because your cruise control doesn't realize if your car is hydroplaning or not, okay? And that can get you into some problems there. So rain is moving in. Wet conditions are the story here out the door this morning. We've gotten some good rainfall so far, up to about a tenth of an inch, almost a fifteenth of an inch of some rain here at the airport. Most of the east sides have yet to really get up the heavier totals. But that's still on the way. The heavier totals have now shifted into West Oklahoma, many spots up near a quarter of an inch of rain, and that rain is still falling. So we'll keep adding to that 50 right now. South winds at 11. Big story today is going to be all the wind we're expecting. The winds are going to start gusting 15, 25, maybe a few gusts up near 30 this morning, and the light switch goes on about 10 o'clock this morning with many gusts 40 to near 50 miles per hour much of your afternoon today. So make sure you are ready to go. The winds will be a big story, blustery forecast. That'll take us through the day today. Once that rain moves out, the winds kick in. I love we'll wind sustained 25, 30, 35 miles per hour much of the day today. Now we'll have a nicer day temperature wise up near 66 by four o'clock, but it's gonna be very windy. Uh, coming up for today. We're near 50 right now, some 40s in the west, a little cold, colder there with the wind in the forecast. You'll need a little jacket or, or maybe a light coat coming up, but a blustery uh, Valentine's Day on the way. Some 60s, some 70s in southwest Oklahoma and might even see a few 50s over here in eastern parts of the state. We've got 67 for high coming up for today. So that rain this morning, this is kind of a snapshot. We're expecting about 8 o'clock this morning. They'll be ending in central Oklahoma. Still some rain in eastern portions, but that'll gradually end as well. And we'll track some fire danger later today. So the rain ends and you have all that dormant vegetation above ground. It dries out. So threat for some wildfire danger will be possible in western and far southwest parts of Oklahoma. So make sure to be mindful of that as well. So tomorrow we'll see those temperatures kind of range. Look at these temps from 30 out in the panhandle to near 70, 70 plus across southern and the eastern portions of the state. We'll get close to 70 here in Oklahoma City. And that's ahead of this big storm that'll be moving out tomorrow. Some severe weather in southeast parts of Oklahoma with some hail, some wind. There's a low tornado threat. Those storms may spin a little bit. So we'll monitor that Seminole down to Ardmore and east of there. Here's your rain chances, east Oklahoma. There's your snow chances in the panhandle that starts rolling on in, moving up across Oklahoma with a little snow by Wednesday night. That all scoots on out by Thursday morning, where some areas in the panhandle might get close to two to four, maybe locally up to six inches of snowfall. 
So forecast again, we're talking that rain chance diminishing. We'll see a few more chances coming in by uh, Thursday night and then expect to see things dry back out. We'll see some 50s and some 60s headed toward the pan toward the weekend, getting close to 70 by Sunday and Monday.